Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hi, how are you? I'm Audrey. If you are new here, welcome to my channel. I'm Audrey and this is another episode of the Not So Berry Legacy. And oh my gosh, okay. Um, wow. So yeah, Mimosa was... <laughs> Mimosa is feeling a little lonely, so she called up August, and he came over. They literally just did the nasty. Um, she's not, like, super attracted to him, but he's, like, in love with her. As you can see, he's serenading her. Oh, my God. He has a really great voice. Like, he has a really great voice. I can't tell if she's in- wait, she is! <gasps> oh my god, okay. Uh, okay, cool. Wait. Stop. Um, I'm pretty sure he used a condom, so I'm not sure, but you know what? We're just gonna go ahead and take a pregnancy test because, um, yeah. So, today, Mimosa does have to go to work, and I do want to work a little bit more towards her um, aspiration as well, as far as finishing three books. We go to work in 13 minutes, um, and then she also has a whim that she wants to schedule a date. So, I think we're actually going to schedule a date with Lou, uh, the werewolf. She does find him very, very interesting. Um, she's never met, like, a werewolf or anything. I'm happy to continue this conversation. Okay, yeah, she's been getting a lot of matches on Fruity Sims. So, okay, we're gonna cross our fingers and hope that Mimosa is not pregnant because she's just, um, yeah. Oh my god, shut up. Okay, she's not. Oh, thank god. Okay, Mimosa's not pregnant. Okay, awesome perfect okay so search alien crater oh my god this is perfect you can find the alien craters outside of the lab oh my gosh this is perfect okay so since mimosa is at work now she is going to as you can see she started on the rocket ship but we are going to work on um a little bit more of the rocket ship i'm looking for this alien crater that they're talking about um <laughs> i don't know <laughs> Um, Kasim, yeah, everyone just wants to match. I swear to God, Mimosa is like, everyone just wants to match with Mimosa, and like, everyone just wants to date her. Um, I don't know if I want to make her monogamous or not, like, with the way that she just kind of like falls in love with people. Um, but okay, I don't know where the like alien crater is, but it says find collectibles chat with co-workers okay so it looks like she is so what are you doing why are you being such a creep okay um we're i don't know if you guys remember but we aren't working on the elements collection or anything like that for this particular not so berry uh mint gen it's just kind of gonna be mimosa living her life i do kind of want to get her maybe to the top of the scientist career uh but uh let's go ahead and ask for metal i think that counts as chatting and so we are gonna have her do her like typical work task and we'll have her do a few of them chat Um, hobbies. Uh, yeah. Okay, so she also needs to find some collectibles, which I don't see any dig spots around here. Oh, they're over here. Okay, just kidding. I lied. Okay, so I'll have her do that. We'll have her go and um, dig for some collectibles while she's here because i want um, mimosa wants to you know do her part in the lab and kind of pull her own weight but she also really just kind of wants to work on her own stuff clone a crystal let's go okay we have a cloning machine it is over here um i don't know does she have any crystals i think she does yeah we have a crystal right here okay so 
a clone object. And then, what is this? Oh, okay. Um, how's her water bottle, by the way? It's half full, actually. Okay, her, her, her little bit is Q. Her thing is full. Her Q is full. Oh my gosh, I can't talk. I don't know where this alien crater is. Um, I legitimately tried looking for it. But I can't find anything that would make sense to me as to being an alien crater. Like I wish it would take it to you, but it just it just says it like it's like I'm supposed to know where it's at. And I, I, I don't know where it's at, so we're not gonna even bother. Um, okay. I am then going to, she's finding a lot of crystals, which is nice. Um, we'll have her open up this capsule and then we're just going to sell whatever is inside. Uh, I don't understand why her, oh, well, I guess that makes sense. Uh, since it is getting low, we'll go ahead and have her, um, we'll have her just like eat something real quick. Uh, let's do do a fruit and yogurt parfait and then uh, oh my gosh okay I think Mimosa is going to call up her parents because her fear of death like she needs to talk to someone or maybe she'll call up Vanessa um, just to kind of talk to someone about her fears and everything like that since her and Vanessa are good friends uh, she can talk to I think oh my god what's the same thing is it Danny uh, yeah, she could talk to Danny. I would put her on a date with like someone she's already been on a date with. Um, she's matched with quite a few Sims on the, but I, I really want her to get to know Lou. Um, her and Desi are really close. They haven't talked in a little bit, so we might, she might go and hang out with Desi. Um, but I do really want her to go and hang out with Lou and kind of, and Mimosa wants to hang out with Lou too. Like she thinks it's really interesting. Okay, so... Um, we're gonna put these in our inventory and then, um, oh, she only found six collectibles. Oy vey. Okay, so then that'll be seven. And then we have, uh, eight. Oh, but I guess then it too, it depends like if she actually finds anything. Well, if anything, we can just get um, some rocks and stuff from our uh, co-workers. So, oh my gosh, not him. Okay, so we're going to say maybe next time. Mimos is like, uh, sorry, like not really wanting to right now. That's the thing. Like August really, really likes Mimosa, but she is just kind of met about him. Like she... She just wants to be friends with him and occasionally maybe hook up. So, um, yeah, she's probably going to have to just kind of explain. She doesn't want anything super serious with him. Um, but he is a great guy. <laughs> she's like, mm, you're great, but not for me. Oh, she's getting stinky. That's fine. <clears throat> Mimosa is back home. We did leave work early. We weren't able to attend the little event thing with uh, Basil, but she completely understood. So we are going to, it is 7 p.m. I think Mimosa is going to go ahead and we'll have her uh, grab a pomegranate to just have a quick meal. And then um, she is going to ask Lou out on a date. We might as well make it a date. Like we're gonna go, um, oh, okay. Maybe, do I have to do it through here? How does this, <laughs> truth be told, I don't think I've ever, oh God, it's been so long since I've like asked this Sima on a date. I thought it'd be like a, oh, actually she should pay her bills as well. Um, yeah, okay, so she should pay her bills and then I, why did I think? Oh. Okay. Uh. 
I guess let's just invite him to hang out at the lot and then Mimosa can like cook some dinner or something like that. Um, <clears throat> okay, yeah, let's clean out our spoiled food. Basil. Hey, honey, it's mom. We're going to come visit. When are you going to come visit? I put all my love and effort into raising you. You can at least drop by. Um, okay, so we'll visit. She's going to visit her parents tomorrow. Uh, oh, my gosh. It's like, that's true. She hasn't visited them since she has moved to San Myshuno. Um, She did drop by, like, the next day. But after that, she hasn't really visited them. And she hasn't had her parents over either. Not that I can... Did we? Did we have our parents over? No, we didn't. Mimosa just had lunch with them. So I guess I can understand her parents. Like, why haven't you, like, invited us to your house? Um, I think it'll be interesting if we have Desi and, um... No, you know what? We'll just... I don't know. I know Mimosa really wants to go on a date, but I think... Yeah, you know what? We can invite... I don't know who she would want to hang out with more. Okay, so Lou is on his way over, meaning he'll be over in like a couple minutes. And I think we will go ahead and have Mimosa cook some food. What she's going to cook, I honestly, I don't even know. Let's see. It is more of a dinner. It looks like he's already here. So I think. Uh, it's hot, so maybe if we just do... Okay, I don't want to do anything, like, super crazy. Um, we'll just do baked salmon. Oh, and he's here in his... Oh my gosh, I forgot to do that. Um, <laughs> get the... He's just naked in his little form. I'm dead. Oh my gosh, I forgot to do the... Take the shoes off of wolves, but, um... Uh, she does just kind of want to get to know <laughs> get to know him oh my gosh I don't know I expected Lou to have clothes but I guess not he's just like yeah I'm not about that life <laughs> uh, oh my goodness uh, this is so funny okay I actually haven't played with werewolves like at all so and I know what I know what Lou looks like so like this whole thing, I'm just like super curious. Like I, I try not to uh, force my Sims relationships, but I need her to, this is like my first Sim that's come in contact with Lou. Okay, so. Okay, so she's like, hey, I made um, dinner if you want to come and eat. And so it looks like Lou is going to come down and eat. We also have like um, a fruit little thing right here as well, which I think we'll put. Um, actually, we're going to go ahead and put this on the. Uh, we'll put it right here. I think that's a great place to put it. Yeah. Oh, he's not going to sit with us. Oh my goodness. Okay. They haven't had a conversation yet. It's just been a little awkward, but Moza is going to go ahead and she is going to go ahead and flatter him. Oh my God. Bruh. Hey, I saw Eliza making out. Oh my God. What <laughs> I saw Eliza making out with Mortimer. <gasps> oh my gosh. That's crazy. Uh, discuss recent reads. 
But yeah, like I was saying, uh, I do want her to, I do want her to get to know Lou. Babes, where you at? Okay, she's still in her towel. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Um. Uh. <laughs> a pup? I don't know what that means, y'all. What does a pup mean? What? Does it mean he's like not a full grown uh okay so yeah mimosa is just gonna kind of so mimosa is just going to just talk to lou kind of get to know him she's like hey so you know i've never met a werewolf before and, you know, he's like, you know, some sims are full of imagination stories to get Lou inspired. Nice. So he's super inspired by their conversation. Mimosa is being, like, really kind about her questions. She's just super curious. He's asking about her. He's like, yeah, I think I've, like, I think I've, like, heard about you or whatever. And she's like, yeah, yeah, my story's kind of crazy. But I'm here. I'm just kind of, you know, feeling out San Myshuno and the people here. And so far, it's so good. Okay. So they seem to be getting on really well, which is nice. I'm really curious about what the disable furry effect does. Does it, is, is Luke going to be naked? Hold on. I'm very curious. I don't know what that does. It didn't do anything. Okay. Um, I wonder if... Oh my gosh, girl. <laughs> Just all the time. Uh, he just looks so silly. Okay. Um, let's have her flirt. I'm very curious. Oh my gosh, she has a half a glass of wine just sitting here. Okay, so, uh, let's see. I don't know. <gasps> Cuddle while stargazing? <gasps> I want to see this. Oh my gosh, this needs to happen, like, right now. Oh my gosh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, let me change her outfit before we go and do this. Okay. Oh my gosh, cuddle while stargazing. I need to see this. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay, they have to be outside. Um, oh, it's raining. Uh, we'll have to do it another time. That sucks. I don't understand this enable furry effect. I don't know what that means. Uh, okay, well. Uh, maybe, maybe we don't have to go outside. Maybe we can just do it here. How cute! Hold on. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. They're not looking at anything. They're not. They're just. They're. We're, we're gonna pretend they're outside. They're great. They have a great imagination. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. 
Oh. My. Oh. Oh. Okay. This is such a cute and Oh my goodness. Stop. Okay. Um. There's no, like, romance bar popping up. I hate this glitch so much. Okay, so she is getting tired. Um, I guess she's gonna go ahead and she's gonna ask Lou if he wants to stay the night. I think you can ask him that, right? Um, flirtation. I guess we could do that, too. We probably should. I mean, the way that... Uh, stay. Okay, I don't think they, I don't think she has that option. So, whoops. Okay, yeah, so Mimosa is tired and she's going to go to bed. So she's like, you know, Lou, if you want to hang out a bit more you are free to do so but i am going to go to bed because i am so tired and she's to... and she has to go to work okay i was like what's he doing so we're gonna have go ahead and have her go to sleep and y'all i think i've decided i kind of want mimosa and lou to be together there's just Oh god, I have to get him out of those boots. I don't know. There's just there's just something. Gosh, if it's not Lou, it's um it's gonna be uh we're just gonna do like a romantic hug. They haven't had their first kiss yet. I do want them to go on a date. Um Mimosa stays tired. Like I don't know what is going on with girl, but like I there's just something with these two. I don't know if it's not, if it's not Lou, it's going to be Desi. It's going to be Desi, but like, oh my gosh. Okay, so I do, can we ask on a date? I do want to have them go on a date. Uh, ask date. Oh, there we go. Okay, perfect. Okay, so we're going to, look at him. He's already in a flirty mood. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, so we are going to go ahead and ask Lou on a date because Mimosa has been dying to go on a date for a hot minute. She also has mail, um, but we'll check her mail later. Okay. That's one of her, one of her, okay, let's go. We're going on a date. Oh my gosh, not Mimosa wearing her Starlight Accolades dress. Of course, Lou's gonna be naked. Okay, so this is obviously one of Mimosa's favorite places to eat. She's taken a couple of dates here, but it's kind of like, it's kind of like her thing, you know? This is where the first dates go, and uh, she, they are both in a full flirty <laughs> mood. I can't. Okay, oh my god, okay, socialize with your date. Oh, wow, I've never... Okay, well, let's hope that this goes well. Everyone's kind of coming in now. Everyone looks so nice. And then there's Lou. I love this. Okay. So as of right now, Mimosa has not seen Lou in his human form. Uh, he's kind of talked about it, but as far as she knows, this is like, this is how he looks all the time because this is how she's always seen him. Um, where's our table? Hello? Okay, we're being sat over here. Oh, I think someone wants her autograph or something. Oh, no, she was just standing in our way. Rude. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Look at them. They have a cute little view of the city. Oh, I love this. Uh, oh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, they're so cute. Cute. I like like I said if it's not gonna be Lou it's gonna definitely be uh Desi
Okay, so it says to socialize, order food for yourself and your date. Um, okay, I, obviously she still wants to get to know Lou a little bit more. I mean, she has moved really fast with most of her relationships I mean but then again with the like the so we're gonna ask about his love life and then she is just gonna kind of try and get to know him a bit more just because they do seem to be doing so well and then we will go ahead and have her order for the table and it keeps saying like Lou is in love but I'm just like I don't Oh my gosh. I could control him to like see his emotions and stuff, but we'll wait. We'll wait. I kind of want to see how this goes with just Mimosa. Um, we'll go ahead and have her kind of crack like some funny jokes and everything like that. Oh, okay. Um, so a white wine blend. Well, of course that's going to be Mimosa. And I think, gosh, what would Lou like? Let's get him that. I feel like that's very Lou coded. <laughs> uh, okay, and then we obviously we're gonna get him um, steak, and I think for mimosa we'll get her the lobster tortellini. And there we go. So they're gonna talk. She's like, you know, I have been really enjoying our time together even though i know we just met i've been having a lot of fun hanging out with you and talking with you um and just definitely want to get to know you better um yeah sure we'll have them talk about marriage like that's an important thing to know you know like how do you feel about marriage and everything like that so they are gonna just how interesting when most likes discussing interests of course and so like yeah he's talking more about like being a werewolf and kind of everything and just you know we'll have them have a deep conversation i think there's the deep discussions which is what i was looking for um deep thoughts uh you know what we'll have her hey i saw your fruity oh my god <laughs> he is an art lover oh my gosh that's perfect stop this is going so well. And like Mimosa is kind of like opening up to him a little bit more than she has to other people. She's discussing like her fears. She's having like deep conversations, which she doesn't have with, you know, other people outside of her parents. Um, so they're able to kind of just talk more in depth with things. Drugs. Okay. I was like, is he a drug dealer? um so let's see okay it's under the friendly I keep forgetting it's under the friendly I just tend to type out um so I guess we can do that again because it says have a deep conversation so we'll have that twice and They just became good friends. Oh, they got their food. Okay, where's our food coming? <gasps> our food's right here. Um, hello. Okay. Uh, okay, that's not our food. Lobster tortellini and a garden salad. Okay. Well, that's not our food. Made by Knox. Oh, Knox the chef. How interesting. Look at them. They actually coordinate. How cute. Who's this? <gasps> Look at these little families. Oh, this is the Michelson family. Or Michelson? Is it Michelson? Oh, look at that. They're all dressed up. So cute. Okay, where's our food at, though? Okay. 
<gasps> Here's our food! Actually, it taking that long is perfect because, like, they had time to really talk and get to know each other some more. Oh, they both really like their food. Okay, Mimosa, you have to do... Oh, okay. Or not. Oh, where are you going? Why are we standing up? Meal. Enthuse about meal. Uh, food? Discuss food flavors. Maybe it's because of, of how he eats. I don't know. Uh, okay, now he's sitting down. I was like, what are we doing here? Oh my goodness. Look at this. They're so cute. I think that this date has gone really, really well. So well that they are going to have a little kiss. Okay, that's that's a way more intense kiss than I was expecting. I, it's like a new interaction. But like, oh my gosh, y'all. I can't. I love them so much together, low key. Oh my goodness, I wasn't expecting this. Like, I really, like, I was kind of going for Desi or Danny for mimosa but Lou I think I might have found I think I might have found the one for mimosa so the only other person she has a really kind of had this compassion with is Desi that was on their first date and so butterflies in the sky mimosa feels high of the sizzling moment spent with Lou mimosa has a full heart and head in her clouds she will be daydreaming about Lou's electrifying touch for a while mimosa can take pleasure of up to two passionate moments a few times a day every passionate moment boosts mimosa's well-being and helps her stay happy with special lucky effects okay so that's new that's exciting what were they gonna do what were you guys gonna do um oh my gosh okay so we are gonna go ahead and we're going to and we're gonna pay for the table and i want to say oh my gosh of course paparazzi's here but Mosa does not care. So we're going to blow a kiss. I don't know if we want to make it official yet. I don't think she wants to yet. But I mean, everything is going so well with them that she's like, you know what? I just kind of want to spend the rest, uh, have a good night with you. Um, but we're not going to ask him to be our boyfriend yet. No, 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 no. Oh my God. Sims are farting left and right. Um... Give little kisses and oh my god, that both of them cheesing. Let's see. Oh my god, stop. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so sorry. I'm just like, <laughs> so cute. Uh, I really... Oh, is this Brittany Choi? Who's this? Um, that is Brittany Choi. Okay. Honestly? <laughs> they're just so cute. Uh, I wasn't expecting this. Like, I wasn't expecting to like them together as much as I am. But, like, I just, I just think it's, I think Lou is very fitting for Mimosa. But again, I also really, really like Desi for Mimosa as well. Um, okay, let's open up. Let's see the sentiments. So, deeply connected. It's saying, okay, wait, what are, what are hers and Desi says? Like, what does... They... 
and her and Desi slept with each other on the first date too. Um, I think we are going to go ahead and end the date early though, but it went obviously really, really well, something special. And um, I don't know where he went. I want to say he left, but he might have went to the bathroom. Um, let me see. Yeah, he left, okay. Well, she had a really great date. We are going to end the episode here. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you think. I I, I think Mimosa is going to end up dating Lou. Like, I think that's going to be her. <laughs> I think that's going to be her man. Um, after all this time in the dating pool with Sam Shuno, I think she's going to end up with the werewolf man. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will see she is so high right now. Oh my god, look at her eyes girl. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you all in the next video. Bye!